Good day viewers. Many individuals, both online and offline, are praising the benefits of performing planks every day. As a result, numerous fitness professionals and gurus have created daily plank challenges to inspire even more individuals to start practicing planks on a regular basis. Are you new to plank and want to learn about the health benefits it provides? If you answered yes to our questions, keep watching this video because we're going to talk about what happens to your body if you plank for a week. A like before we proceed would be fantastic. Why do planks on a daily basis? Because of the publicity, many of us may succumb to such a challenge. When you see your coworker's spouse or family members performing planks and crunches every day, you're more than inclined to join in on the fun. Although it is beneficial to exercise, practicing planks every day is the incorrect way to go because you do not have a goal in mind. You may begin the task just to impress your partner or to support your sister or brother, but you will eventually abandon it. This might happen if you don't have a clear objective in mind to keep you motivated to complete a task. Knowing this, take the time to research why you should begin such an exercise program. Most of the time, your aim will coincide with the advantages of executing the exercises. Let's take a look at the benefits of exercising planks every day for a week. This is what happens to your body if you plank every day for a week. When most individuals think about planks, they picture themselves with a six-pack. It's probably the most prevalent reason people engage in these activities. Planking, on the other hand, provides more health benefits than merely shaping your abs. 1. Strengthening of the core. Performing a high plank every day can help you strengthen your core. All of your core muscles, including your erector spinae, transversus abdominis, rectus abdominis, lumbar multifidus, and internal and external obliques, are targeted during this exercise. These core muscles must be developed since they support a variety of other body processes. 1. Alleviating back pain. 2. Increasing your flexibility and stability in your balance. 3. Lower your chances of falling and being hurt. Another study found that core strength helps protect the spine from excessive force generation during sports activities, which could explain why players are frequently encouraged to include planks in their training routine. Remember that only performing planks correctly will develop your core strength, so take your time and learn how to plank properly. 2. Improved overall fitness and health. Doing planks every day for a week can also enhance your general health and fitness. These workouts engage a variety of muscle groups, making them especially useful for developing general fitness. Your back and core muscles are targeted in a typical plank. Others, like the side plank version, focus on your glutes and abs. Planks activate all of these muscles, which is why this exercise may help tone your complete body while also shedding a significant amount of body fat, which has been linked to a lower risk of obesity and other serious health concerns. Various malignancies, type 2 diabetes, and congestive heart failure are among them. Coronary artery disease hypertension stroke planks lessen your chance of osteoarthritis and pulmonary embolism by lowering your body fat and obesity risk. They also lower your risk of these obesity-related health disorders. 3. Improved metabolism. Planks every day for a week can also help raise your metabolism, albeit they aren't high on the list of metabolism-boosting activities. Despite the fact that you are encouraged to integrate workouts such as burpees and mountain climbers for a much faster metabolism, there is no doubt that this activity can increase your metabolism marginally. If you want to boost your metabolism without changing your workout routine, we recommend paying special attention to your nutrition. Start by eating modest meals at regular intervals, your body thrives on consistency and balance. This implies that if you consume it on a regular basis, your body will be able to maintain a metabolic balance. Second, Concentrating on consuming adequate calories while skipping meals will not cause your body to lose fat around your abdomen rapidly. It has a negative influence on your metabolism since fewer calories slow down your body's metabolism. You may also speed up your metabolism by consuming enough water. Water is necessary for a healthy metabolism. 4. Sculpted abs. Of course, when it comes to ab workouts, we'll start with the advantage that most people are familiar with, obtaining ripped abs. When it comes to training your abdominal area for a six-pack, most people equate crunches to planks. However, practicing crunches for a slim midsection is also a good notion. However, if you want your crunches to burn fat in your abdominal region, you'll need to fast advance to another ab workout, according to these fitness gurus, who advocate completing the plank exercise. Because it engages the majority of your abdominal muscles, including the internal and external obliques, transversus subdominance, and rectus abdominis, it is beneficial. 
The upper abdominal muscular layer is referred to as the rectus abdominis, while the deepest abdominal muscle is referred to as the transversus abdominis. However, you cannot just get refined abs by doing this exercise. Good nutrition is critical, which is why you must watch your diet. Eating a balanced and healthy diet that helps you maintain a calorie deficit and shed fat around your abdomen will shorten your road to getting a six-pack. To learn more about the best meals to help you shed fat or maintain a calorie deficit, talk to your nutritionist. 5. A decrease in love handles. Don't be deceived by the term. These love handles refer to the fat deposits that sit around your waistline. Other people may refer to them as muffin tops. These muffin tops are linked to a variety of health issues, which is why you should seek to blast fat around your waistline. An expanded waistline is linked to an increased risk of cardiovascular disease, high blood pressure, type 2 diabetes, abnormal cholesterol, and breathing problems, according to the Mayo Clinic Center for Disease Prevention and Control. To reduce your risk of developing these conditions, visit the Mayo Clinic Center for Disease Prevention and Control. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention recommends that women keep their waist sizes or circumferences below 35 inches. Planks can help you trim down to these inches. The side plank is the most effective plank to help lower your love handles. It targets the muscles along the sides of your body, also known as your obliques. 6. Boost Everyday Performance Even if you simply perform planks once a day for a week, you may increase the functionality of your regular tasks. Remember that while doing a plank, you get to heavily engage your arms, shoulders, and neck. Your arms and shoulders are heavily involved in supporting your body weight, so doing these gives these body parts a great workout. It also increases their strength, which helps you perform better in your daily activities, especially those that require lifting. 7. A stronger posture. Many of us struggle with bad postures as a result of the nature of our professions, where we spend the majority of our time behind a desk, impacting how we position our backs, shoulders, and necks. Incorporating planks into your daily routine can also help you improve your posture. Many of us end up arching our backs and putting our shoulders forward. You may have been taught to bring your shoulders back and straighten your back once or twice, but this terrible posture occurs when you spend most of your time sitting. Planks can help you establish better posture, even if you're in a horizontal position. Remember that you're using the same muscles as when you're standing, and they're specifically working your back muscles and helping them stay straight. This is accomplished by activating your glutes and lumbar spinae, which keep your back from arching. Because people are creatures of habit, you will discover that you will tend to maintain this back position throughout the day, even when you are not exercising, by performing this exercise. Do you believe you'll be able to do planks for a week in a row? Please share it with us in the comments below. If you like the video give it a thumbs up. For more secrets and tips, subscribe to the channel. Before you go, here are two more videos you should check out both of them will help you reach your goals. Click to watch them now, see you in our next video.